Welcome CMAP board, families, and guests. My name is Jasmine Omeki, and I would like to welcome you to the second annual FLIP program, final presentation program. During the duration of the FLIP program, my fellow participants and I intro were introduced to the GoTo 2040 plan. This plan aims to usher the northeastern counties of Illinois into better horizons in the year of 2040. This program was brought to my attention by a club sponsor. I was immediately drawn in by the program's goal to make teens aware of the issues of the region while shaping them into future leaders. When I signed up, I had no idea what ensued. For six months, my fellow participants and I volunteered our time one Saturday a month. Many of us had to wake up early and had commutes of an hour or more to get to the CMAP offices. We were initially split into five committees, which focused on housing, environment, transportation, economic development, and human services. With the help of our FLIP leaders, Drew, Diana, Locke, Chris, Carly, Justine, and Aaron, we trekked throughout the region, visiting diverse places, such as an organic farm within the city, the CTA control room, different housing developments, various communities around the region, and the list goes on. My favorite excursion occurred when we were taken to visit Glenview and Prairie Crossing, two different communities that applied mixed-use practices in different ways. Glenview was a suburb that used shared parks and carefully planned gridding systems to bring its citizens together. Prairie Crossing, on the other hand, used native plants and specific home architecture and placement to give back to the environment while making a suitable community for new families. In addition, we also got the chance to interview professionals in our respective fields. Each experience gave our committees the chance to explore particular topics in depth and formulate ideas about how the issues of the community of the region could be solved. All in all, I believe that each participant was taught to realize that the region cannot solve its problems without reaching out to each part of the region, not only Cook County, Kendall County, or Lake County. I met other teens and counties that I would have never met if I wouldn't have joined the FLIP program. This program broadened my eyes. It gave me the tools to identify a certain issue within my committee and seek ways to solve it in a unique way. After months of exploring the region, talking to professionals, and carrying out careful research, each committee sought to solve a certain problem that affected teens in the region. Each group considered the plans of the preferred regional scenario, which has facilitated the GO2 2040 plan so that it could be implemented in the coming years. And we use this information and develop guidebooks, presentations, guidebooks and presentations to help teens implement the regional scenario in a variety of ways. Tonight, each committee will unveil its plan of attack regarding a certain issue. Our presentations will begin with my group, the Human Services Committee. Our group project is called Working on Wellness. I hope you enjoyed learning more about the region. Thank you. 